Jay, give me a chance to get back into The Last of Us on Grounded Mode. This will be episode 32. Hopefully it's the last episode, but we'll wait and see what happens. Let's get back into it. Small screen, golden screen, small and golden screen. Um, yeah, how's everyone doing today? Hope everyone's well. Hope all your family members are well. Hope all your elderly family members are well. Hope all your kids are enjoying school if they've got back to school. What? He's dead. We got a man down. The smugglers escaped. Locate the target and eliminate it. We'll search the other floors. Yes, sir. Search the floor. Find that smuggler and shoot him on sight. Jesus!
Fuck! Watch my back!
April 28th. Marlene was right. The girl's infection is like nothing I've ever seen. The cause of her immunity is uncertain. As we've seen in all past cases, the antigenic titers of the patient's cordyceps remain high in both the serum and the cerebrospinal fluid. Blood cultures taken from the patient rapidly grow cordyceps and fungal media in the lab. However, white blood cell lines, including percentages and absolute counts, are completely normal. There is no elevation of pro-inflammatory cytokines, and an MRI of the brain shows no evidence of fungal growth in the limbic regions, which would normally accompany the prodrome of aggression in infected patients. We must find a way to replicate this state under laboratory conditions. We're about to hit a milestone in human history equal to the discovery of penicillin. After years of wandering in circles, we're about to come home, make a difference, and bring the human race back into control of its own destiny. All of our sacrifices and the hundreds of men and women who've bled for this cause, or worse, will not be in vain. It's 5.30 p.m. on April 28th. It's 5.30 p.m. I just finished speaking, I don't know, more like yelling at our head surgeon. Apparently, there's no way to extricate the parasite without eliminating the host. Fancy way of saying you gotta kill the fucking kid. And now they're asking for my go-ahead. The test just keeps getting harder. And harder, don't they? The tests just keep getting harder and harder, don't they? I'm so tired. I'm exhausted. I'm so tired. And I just want this to end. I'm exhausted. And I just want this to end. So be it. My chifty, we find you cross the Utah border in a couple of days. We'll be back to Lovers. The later crew was in much better spirits. I've been worried about the moral morale morale since Greg and Tanya's passing last week. It's good to hear them laughing again. Robin came up to me and said, Thanks for watching over us, Marley. It's, uh, it was a small gesture, but I needed it. March 23rd. Ellie never made it. We arrived at the hospital. There was much celebration at least 
among the others, I guess. They're happy to see their old friends. We have and seen them, seen some of them, these, some of these guys, sorry, my bad, in over 10 years. After they told me they knew I couldn't eat, I couldn't even talk to them. I should be grateful to just be alive, but right now I just want to shut my eyes for a bit. March 24th. They look at me and I know what we're taking. That we're a bunch of incompetent. Incompetent. Um. Grunt. What was I supposed to do? I thought I was going to die. My men were being hunted by the entire Boston position. I had to get her out of the city. How was I supposed to know the Firefly Escort were all dead? Oh damn it. I panicked and in the end I killed the damn quickly and my men were more capable than I gave him credit for. More than a handful survived the army at army's attack. I should have kept her with me. Instead, I handed her over to a couple of smugglers. I failed you, Anna. I failed all of us. I am incompetent grunt. April 25th. I can't stand talking to any of them. I don't think I can take the stairs any longer. No way I can stay here. April 20th. Come of one of the scouts just radioed in. He spotted on I spotted an older man and a young girl entering the tunnel by the bus terminal. He thinks she might be might might have had red hair, but he's not sure what it is to stop doing his money. I, uh, we can't squad is about to head out and go to join them. 20, April 28. When you lost in the dark, look for the light. Mm. She, uh, she's alive. They're, they're running the test on her now. Can, I can't tell if I'm excited, scared, or just nervous. All I know is I'm my hand, my hand was not shaking. Yeah, that's it. I'm coming out. Save game, even though there's no points really because I don't even save where you are. Just back to the beginning, it's just stupid.
last one over here! Scan the perimeter! What the hell? Where are you, you motherfucker?
That's filthy idiot. Well, okay. You guys, go check out.
Kochka. Does hold. What about you? I'm going over this way. You guys, go check over there. You guys, go check over there. What you got? Nothing. You better look out here. You guys, go check over there. Where the hell are you?
thought they just two guys there. out here.
back over. The fuck? You buy me some time. Hey, Anna. It's been a while since we spoke. I just gave the okay to proceed with the surgery. I really doubt I had much of a choice. Asking me was more of a formality. I need you to know that I've kept my promise all these years. Despite everything that I was in charge of, I looked after her. I would have done anything for her, and at times, I... a chance to save us. All of us. This is what we were after. What you were after. They asked me to kill the smuggler. I'm not about to kill the one man in this facility that might understand the weight of this choice. Maybe he can forgive me. Save. Uh, yes. Yes. Go to the toilet really quick.
kali satu kau nih bisa tah. Sweet Jesus. Doctor, what are you doing in here? I won't let you take her. This is our future. Think of all the lives we'll save. can't save her. Even if you get her out of here, then what? How long before she's torn to pieces by a pack of clickers? That is, if she hasn't been raped and murdered first. It ain't for you to decide. It's what she'd want. And you know it. Bitch. Look. You can still... Do the right thing here. She won't feel anything. There's a whole lot more like you, Ellie. People that are immune. There's dozens, actually. Ain't done a damn bit of good, neither. They've actually... They've stopped looking for a cure. I'm taking this home.
sorry. Wait! Let me go! Please. You just come after her. Like we're walking. Should be a straight shot through here. All right. It's actually kind of pretty, ain't it? Yeah. All right. Now watch your head going through. Now, but uh, Sarah and I used to take hikes like this. I think uh, I think the two of you would have been would have been good friends. I think you really would have liked. Her. I know she'd have liked you. I bet I would have. further now. Back in Boston? Back when I was bitten? I wasn't alone. My best friend was there. And she got bit too. We didn't know what to do. So... She says... Let's just wait it out. You know, we can be all poetic and just lose our minds together. I'm still waiting for my turn. Ellie. Her name was Riley, and she was the first to die. And then it was Tess. And then Sam. None of that is on you. Pop, you don't understand. I struggled for a long time with surviving. And you... No matter what... You keep finding something to fight for. Now, I know that's not what you want to hear right now. Swear now, to me. Swear to me that everything that you've said about the Fireflies is true. I swear.
well, thanks for watching, guys. I mean, I hope you guys enjoyed this playthrough of The Last of Us on Garden Mode. Uh, please comment down below and like and subscribe if you want to see more gameplay videos from me. Um, yeah, see you next time, guys. Bye.